Hey guys, how's it going? Tis back again with episode number two of this pack opening. We had 4,600 FIFA points. We've opened 2,400 so far, as my maths is uh, absolutely woeful. It took me forever to figure that out. And uh, if you did miss part one, then do feel free to check the channel page to go back to it. I will probably leave an annotation on screen around about now, somewhere on screen, so that you can go and check that out. We did pull an informed player and another Barcelona player as well, so do feel free to go and check that episode out if you did miss it but let's crack on with this one shall we we're looking to try and pull some more uh, valuable players as we look to boost our coin stack early on in this year's FIFA 14 Ultimate Team I'm not going to be able to afford to do too many big pack openings like this so this is going to be quite a uh, quite a one-off special uh, couple of videos as we pull Junior Hoylet for the second time uh, in this particular two-part pack opening uh, and that's the third League 2 manager thing we've pulled as well nice flamingo kit though red and white red and black stripes rather uh, let's put a junior hoiler in the tray pile shall we uh, that was my phone that went off by the way if that if you did hear that in the background this mic that i use is particularly sensitive uh, i do enjoy using it for uh, for commentating etc it is quite good quality as far as i can make out with uh, listening to the uh, the episodes back etc but uh, it's quite cheap as well actually only 17 pounds microsoft headsets we pull viviano arsenal's new signing in goal Decent stats, actually. He does look half decent. I uh, I didn't know how good his stats were. So we pull also an Everton James McCarthy. Obviously moves for £13 million, I think it was, in the summer from Wigan to rejoin Roberto Martinez at uh, at Everton. Decent signing, although still a lot of uh, a lot of scope for improvement as a as a player. But he's still quite young, so he's definitely got that in his bag. So let's open another one. Radamel Falcao on the front. Can we get Radamel Falcao in the pack? Let's wait and see as the Golden Globe spins around. We pull Joe Cole. <laughs> not, uh, not what I was hoping for. Joe Cole, a Berea and a Naked or Nitted. Uh, a Catalyst. I've not seen that one before. I'm not too sure what that improves, that chemistry style. But we will put that into the club. And I will assign that to a player later on in the day. But uh, you'll probably be seeing these on Monday. Uh, you will have had a... Uh, League One at 10k squad builder on Saturday so if you did miss that do feel free to check the channel page for that and then back to uh, double upload yesterday for uh, for career mode and uh, and the Pac-Man series and then these two parts will be going up during the day on Monday so you guys can feel free to check the channel page like I have said quite a few times now for episode one of this uh, this two part pack opening we've got 1600 FIFA points left around about 10 packs so uh, hopefully we can pull something in at the latter part of this of this pack opening. We've done quite well actually. I'm not too sure what Inform Leighton Baines goes for. Obviously we pulled him in the first pack opening if you didn't see it. So uh, let's see who we get in this one. Allegra Tally. And an Aspi. Yes. Another Chelsea player. Very, very pleased to pull Aspi. He is my favourite right back actually at Chelsea. I prefer him over uh, Ivanovic. I do play Ivanovic at centre back in uh, in head to head seasons. So uh, I do very much prefer Aspi at right back. He's got a little bit more pace and uh, he's better on the ball as well. So um, not quite as good uh, strength wise and defensively, but offensively he is very, very good indeed. So uh, let's see who we can get in this next one. Timmy Cahill on the front. Burnt Leno is the goalkeeper. Oh, I thought, I thought that was Mertens for a minute. No, it's Martins. My uh, my mistake. Polushi. Some decent contracts. Nottingham Forest kit and uh, Dick Van Dyke as well. Hello, mate. We'll, uh, we'll discard you. I'm not really going to try and sell you one in the uh, in the trade pile because you won't sell for anything. Or not trade pile, is it? It's the transfer list. I do like that little addition, changing the uh, the name of the transfer the uh, trade pile to transfer list because it's the players that you're going to bring in, going to be bringing in and changing your watch list to uh, to uh, transfer targets. So as we pull Lucas Lever in this particular pack, decent uh, defensive stats. I'm not too sure how good he is in game, but uh, he will come in very handy. Left forward to left winger card as well decent but uh, Lucas Leib is a decent player I am I will uh, maybe try and put a, a Premier League squad together with that inform Leighton Baines and that Aspi as well if uh, if I can to bring you a squad builder later on either in this week or later on next week uh, I am not doing El Shirawi there we go boys let's go that is a fantastic signing not too sure what he goes for around about 10 grand I think but great pace. I will put him in a Serie A squad for you later on this week if I can bring it out. And I'm going to try and record that this later this week. Russian League manager thing as well, which will come in handy. Maybe I'll do a Russian League squad. Although Sami Eto is obviously now in the Premier League. So uh, maybe maybe uh, we'll have to go with another a, another 
uh, striker up top. Obviously, Wellington isn't in the Russian league anymore, and neither is Emenike. Actually, Emenike might be. I know he's transferred, but I can't remember where to. Uh, Greta, he was in the uh, he was in the the La Liga squad that you will be seeing a little bit later on this week. Uh, so do keep your eye out for him. Ivan Ramis as well. I didn't know that I'd pulled a Ramis, but uh, nonetheless. Uh, let's shove both of those to the trade pile or transfer list as we've covered sorry and uh, let's move swiftly on now obviously you'll see my record in the top is uh, four games won four games lost now uh, two of those lost games were actually against friends this here was a great inclusion actually you get full coins for playing friends in games and it also counts towards your record and obviously players still lose contract and uh, and fitness as well as so we pull Gonzalo Higuain I will put him in the Serie A, uh, Serie A squad as well so we have El Shirawi at left wing and Higuain up top I think as uh, we pull a Benador as well and Pedro Leon uh, four players in that pack five players in that pack rather that's quite nice uh, that will do very nicely indeed let's just have these two the trade pile Pedro Leon not the fastest but he's on the ball so maybe someone might want to pick him up for their own squad in the trade pile transfer list so uh, it's going to get it's going to be quite hard to get out of the habit of calling it trade pile isn't it after four years or five years rather 09 10 11 12 13 calling it the trade pile and of course four as if it's this as if this is the sixth year of Ultimate team that is absolutely mental julio cesar is a fantastic sign and kakar as well in the same pack hello boys let's go he will go very very nicely in the Serie A squad builder we've pulled quite a few players that we'll put in that squad builder in this particular episode haven't we that is amazing I am very very pleased I'm just going to save me money actually going out and buying the players for a squad so uh, you'll see that in the next couple of weeks actually I'm quite pleased we're putting some really really nice players in this particular pack opening I'll get those recorded as soon as possible as well so I can sell them on, sell those particular players on for maximum profit. Micah Richards, there we go. Another fantastic Premier League player and Adam Lalana as well. Decent, these plays are right mid now. That's a bit disappointing actually. He was a cam last year, wasn't he? Another uh, another player that, or another... F no, I'll put him on the transfer list. I didn't want to do that. I wanted to discard him. Never mind. How many uh, FIFA points have we got left? 400. So we do have... Uh, two packs. There is actually gold upgrade packs, so we'll open one of those as well. Uh, we'll open two of these, uh, two of these particular premium gold packs. As we see in this one, we are going to get Atsu again, another player that we've already pulled. This particular pack opening, and nothing else of any particular note. So you can be quick sold. Uh, probably shouldn't have quick sold that. Probably should have sold it, but never mind. Have to forgive me for that. 150 FIFA points. And let's see who we get in this one. Final uh, gold premium pack of this pack opening altogether. And we are going to pull. Please be someone nice. Go on. Treat me. Treat me. Javier Pastore. Decent player. And Akua as well. Decent goalkeeper. Decent defence. Uh, diving and reflex stats actually. Unfortunately Pastore is a right mid. If he was a centre mid he'd probably go for a little bit more. But uh, unfortunately he isn't. As we pull Ruben Castro. Another player that I've also got in uh, in my particular La Liga squad that you'll be seeing a little bit later on this week so uh, do feel free to subscribe if you haven't already to make sure that you don't miss out on that but let's go to the uh, the specials and open this gold promo pack hopefully we can get someone decent in it maybe I don't know whether it's going to give you a player from every position or whether it's just going to uh, it's going to give you 12 random random players Ali Al Hapsi are you sure Let's see if we get any other non rares or any particular note. No, Pereira, De Marcos. Still very, very fast, De Marcos. 89 pace. Obviously, been downgraded. Alex Oxay Chamberlain and Nastasic. They will come in handy as well for maybe a Premier League squad and uh, perhaps to earn me a little bit of coins in the process. But that is going to round this particular squad builder out, guys. So thank you very much for watching. We've pulled some very, very nice players indeed in this particular pack opening. So do feel free to leave the video a like if you could be so kind. That'd be absolutely fantastic. Of course, subscribe if you haven't to make sure you don't miss out on anything on this channel. We do have two regular daily series, the Pac-Man series, which is a pack-only road to glory, and of course, the Tottenham career mode as well. So thank you very much for watching, guys, and I will see you next time.